It has been such a fun week on Daybreak with all the different DNA testing kits. Yes, <laughs> there have been so many, and yeah. we still got some more. Mm -hmm. uh, some kids promise to tell you which exercises are great for you. Some tell you which vitamins you should take, all sorts of stuff. That's right, so Aisha Scott tried one of those. <laughs> Look at her results. Now, I used Vitagene. It also told me which foods I should eat all based on my DNA. I was very surprised by my results. Now, very similar to other DNA kits, you'll have to swab your mouth and mail in your saliva sample. The instructions, though, were fairly easy. It took about one month from the time we ordered the kit to the time I received the results. So let's take a look at my results in my report and what it actually showed. Now, in terms of supplements, magnesium, zinc, and vitamin B complex, these are not the only supplements that it recommends recommended for me, but those were just a few of them. And then let's go to the recommended foods, seaweed, blackberries, and red snapper. I already eat some of these, but those were some of the foods that Vitagene recommended. And then when it comes to exercise, it gives you a target number of calories that you should burn per week. For me, it was about 700. There's also an online calculator that helps you figure out how many times per week you need to do certain exercises to meet that goal. So here's my report. Yoga, about five times per week. These are 60 minute sessions. Tennis, about two times per week, and then boxing only one time per week. Now, an added bonus with Vitagene, it also provides your ancestry report. So let me show you mine. Here's a look at my breakdown. Africa, about 66.32%, uh, about 31%, almost 31% European, and then the others listed American, Jewish, and Asia. So you can see here a basic health report from Vitagene will only run you about $50, but the test that includes the ancestry report will run you about 99 bucks.